for live San Angelo, Texas. Let's see who comes up to bat first for your Lady Lions. It's a game three of the series, tied one and one. And whoever wins tonight continues in the playoff, and whoever loses, go home. Let's see if our young Lady Lions can come up with a win tonight. I want to thank our sponsors, Ozona Bank, West Texas Rehab, Bunger Real Estate, First Baptist Church of Ozona. We got the same uh, pitcher pitching for winners tonight, number three. She's pitched the whole series. And we caught on to her the second second game. First game was a rough game, had a lot of mistakes, a lot of strikeouts. Uh, second game was great, had a lot of hits, hit like we normally do. And uh, looks like our first batter tonight is going to be McKenna Villarreal. She's getting up to warm up over there. Um, I think on deck is Faith Kitos. I think uh, balls are thrown in. They're going to throw down and we're going to have first batter. Faith Kitos on deck. Here comes the first pitch of the game here. And that's going to be a strike. 0-1 on, oh on, one on the batter. Second pitch is going to be a strike also. That's 0-2 on McKenna Villarreal. Looks like a young lady from Winters who jumped out pretty quick, but McKenna has been doing a good job of hitting her the whole series. So let's see if she can continue that, continue that here in this third game of the series. That's a good hit down third base. They're going to call it foul. She was on top of it. Let's see if she can put in the outfield this second hit here. We jumped out on quick in the second game. So what we need to do this game is get some good hits, get some runs in. It's going to be a ball. So we won to the count on the batter. Gonna get a good hit over there to shortstop. She's gonna miss it. McKenna's gonna be safe at first base. So leadoff hit right there gets a single. Up next is Faith Kitos. She's pretty fast, so anywhere she hits it on the field, it's real hard for anybody to throw her out. Faith is going to bunt it. She's going to get thrown out at first, but she's going to advance the runner to second base. So a good bunt there by Faith. And up to bat now is Izzy. Izzy's been doing a good job hitting the ball. See if Izzy can drive in a run here. Looks like Christian Webb's on deck. That's going to be the first strike. 0 1 the count on the batter. Top of the first. One out. That's going to be a high pitch. It looks like Faith's going to steal third base. I mean, not Faith. McKenna's going to steal third base. So 1 and 1 on the batter. 1 away. Got a runner in scoring positions. Let's see if. Uh, Izzy can drive her in. Let's 
I mean, swing and a miss by Izzy. It's a little high, but she went after it. We wanted two on the batter here. That's going to be ball two. Two two on the batter. Be high, be a full count on the batter. So let's see if we can get something going here. Full count on the batter. Make sure Easy makes it a good one. This lady likes to throw a fastball outside. And that's what it is. Is he gonna swing and miss on that one? Two away here. Kristen Webb up to bat for the Lady Lions. Looks like Valetti will be on deck. Kristen Webb's hit a couple home runs this season. Sure be nice if she could rip one off right here. And that first pitch is a strike. A lot of our lady lines are taking that first pitch, and it's usually a fastball. That's going to be a curveball low and outside for strike two, 0 and 2 on the batter. Swing and a miss, strike three. That's three away for your Lady Lions. So we'll take a break between the innings here and we'll be back after a word from our sponsor. All right, we're back, ladies and gentlemen. Three, uh, got three outs. No runs scored for your Lady Lions. Let's see if uh, Valeria can hold them off. She's going to be pitching for the Lady Lions tonight. She did a great job in the second game. Had quite a few strikeouts. First pitch is going to be a ball. Oh, never mind. Sorry. All right. So one and knows the count on the batter. The bottom of the first. That's going to be a strike. Nice pitch by Valeria there. That's going to be a hit. It looks like Izzy's going to snag it up for out number one. Great play by Izzy there. My co-partner Ruben couldn't be here today. He had to make a trip. He had a blowout. 
So I hope Ruben, if you're listening, I hope we get it fixed. Looks like this is going to be number three, the pitcher for Lady Lizards. First pitch is going to be a strike. I won one on the batter, one away. That's going to be a ball. Two and one's a count on the batter. It's going to be a foul ball. One and two on the batter, one away. Looks like you're going to have Moran at first. Alondra Garza at second. Izzy at shortstop. Sorry, I was watching. Swing and a miss. And they're going to drop third strike. And she's going to make it to first there. Got a Skylar Lacey at third. Faith Kidos out here in right field. Kristen Webb in center field. And McKenna Villarreal in left field. And Charlie Oglesby catching for a lady line. See if we can get a double play in here or something. It's going to be hit to third base. Oh, she's going to overthrow first. Thought about going to second. Ends up not doing it, so they're going to advance to second and third. One out. Looks like we could have had three, three up, three down. A couple errors here. This is one thing we gotta stop doing to make mistakes like this. But uh, I'm sure the lay lines will come back. Go ahead and get some outs. Ball one, one and zero on the batter. That's going to be a pass. Oh, they're going to say it hit the batter. So she's going to go to first. It's going to make bases loaded here. One away. Still no runs have been scored yet. On first base is Esperanza Castillo, Patty. There's a strike right there. 0 2 is the count on the batter. Let's see if a lady can. Put it in there for the third strike here. It's going to be up in the air. Great play by Valeria. She's going to get a double play, and that's going to end the inning. Great. Awesome play by Valeria. Charlie tried. She dove out there to catch the ball. She couldn't make it. Valeria picks it up. Tags home for one out. Throws it to first for another, so she gets a double play. No run scored. No one hurt. Uh, still 0-0 zero, zero going into the top of the second. So, with that in between innings, we'll be back for some words from our sponsor. Stay with us because it's a good game.
All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're back. Valeria Garza up to bat for your Lady Lions. Charlie Oglesby on deck. Let's see if uh, Valeria can get us started off here in the second inning. Still 0-0. Zero, zero. That's going to be a hit up in the air. And that's going to be out number one. Looks like Char Charlie Oglesby is coming up to bat. I'd like to see Charlie get a hold of one. Uh, she can hit the ball pretty good. That's going to be a ball one. A one and oh is the count. Charlie B. Oglesby is going to hit it down third base. They're going to throw it over to first and get her out. Great play by the third baseman. She's creeping up there. Uh, what's the right call? It looks like. Esperanza Castillo is going to come up to bat for your Lady Lions. She's done a great job in this series of hitting the ball. Her and McKenna Villarreal have been one of the big ones hitting the ball here. Let's see if Esperanza can get a hit and get on base here. That's a swing and a miss. Strike one. She's going to hit that one. Great hit right out to center field. Going to get on first. Going to stay there. Great single hit right there by Esperanza. Looks like Skylar Lacey's up to bat for the Lady Lions. She did a great job in the second game of hitting the ball. See if she can drive one out there and send Esperanza in. Swing and a miss right there, strike one. There's a hit. It's going to be a foul ball. Oh, and two is the count on the batter. A good hit to shortstop. She's going to bobble the ball. Looks like both runners are going to be safe on first and second. And up to bat now is Alonja Garza for your Lady Lions. Another great hit by Skylar Lacey. Some of these girls have stepped up and they've been hitting the ball this series. Doing a good job hitting the ball. That's going to be ball one. Looks like we're going to steal second and third base. Two outs, one and knows the batter. One and knows the count on the batter. That's going to be inside. Two and oh, the count on the batter. Trying to see on who's on deck, but I can't really see yet. I think we start over. I think it's McKenna Villarreal. It's going to be a fly ball out to a shortstop, and she's going to catch it. And in the inning for the Lady Lions, no run scored. Two outs. We head to the bottom of the second. We'll be back in a few minutes.
All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're back here at Lakeview Stadium. Still a scoreless game, bottom of the second. Been a defensive game so far. Had a couple hits, but people have made some plays. Number 12 up to bat for the Lady Blizzards. That's going to be a hit to Alondra. Alondra's going to scoop it and get her out of first. Great play by Alondra. Make the number 10 for the Lady Blizzards. Yes. It's going to be ball one on the batter. One and oh is the count. One away. That's strike one. One and one is the count on the batter. See if Aletta can put two more in there and get us two away here. Ooh, close call. It's going to be two and one. Oh, going to call that outside. Three and one on the batter here. Low as I'm ball four on the batter. Uh, it's gonna be number nine for the Lady Blizzard. See if maybe we can turn a double play here. Tell you what, third baseman and softball are brave. They do screwed up quite a bit. That's gonna be a swing and a miss. Strike one. Uh, Lady Blizzard thought about stealing second here. Went back. We call that one inside. One and one is a count on the batter. Call that one low, two and one on the batter. That's a swing and a miss right there, strike two. Two and two is the count on the batter. We got one away here in the bottom of the second inning. See if we can uh, get another out here. Call that inside. It's going to make it a full count on the batter. That's, oh wow, I thought that was a strike, but they're going to call it ball four. Number 15 for the Lady Blizzards up. She's the only lefty on the team. They're going to call that a ball. Starting to think this umpire uh, strike zone is the state of Texas outline. Oh, wow. I think they're going to call that a ball. Ball flew out of Valeria's hand there. Patty, this bird next to me is talking to me. He's my partner since Ruben is gone. He's filling in, doing the color for me. He talks a little fast and I can't understand what he's saying, but. I'm gonna call that a ball four also. Base is loaded, one away. Brings up number four for the Lady Blizzards.
That's going to be a strike one right there. Oh, one's a count on the batter. Base is loaded, one away. That's going to be a hit out to center field. Chris Webb's going to get it. And they are not going to take off. So two away for your Lady Lions. Call that one a ball. And one and oh is a count on the batter. It'll be inside. Two and oh is a count on the batter. Strike one on the batter, two and one is the count. She went, they're gonna get strike two. Two and two is the count on the batter here. We need another strike right here by Valetti to end this inning with no damage done. And I think we're at the top of our lineup when we go back in. Oh, I thought that was it. They're going to call that a ball, so it will be a full count. There's two outs. I guess she's out there as one. A little confusion there. A little razzle dazzle. We need some razzle dazzle on this pitch right here. It gets track three. That's going to be strike three. That's three away for your Lady Lions. A heck of a job by Valetia pitching. She's played a great game so far. We're going to go to the top of the third inning and we'll be back in a couple minutes. We'll hear some words from our sponsors.
heck of a play by Lady Blizzard shortstop there. Got McKenna Villarreal out. Up to bat down is Faith Kitos for your Lady Lions. That's going to be a little outside. One and O is the count on the batter. Both teams hitting the ball. Just a great defense by both teams. That's going to be ball two. Two and O is the count on the batter. They're going to call that a strike, so that's two and one on the batter. That's going to be flat up to for the third base. Shortstop's going to run over there and make the play. That's two away for the Lady Lions. Looks like Izzy's going to be up for your Lady Lions. See if she can get started. Something started here. Top of the third inning. Sorry about the birds chirping. They're uh, wanting to get in on the action too. And I don't know where they're at. I'm right, gonna call that a strike. One and no on the batter. Ball one on right there. One and one's a count, two away here in the top of the third inning. Still a scoreless game. That's going to be ball two. Swing and a miss for strike two. Two twos the count on the batter. Swing and a miss. She's going to miss a third strike. Looks like he is. He's going to be safe at first. So those on Lady Lions catch a break there. It's going to be Kristen Webb up to bat for the Lady Lions. Melania Garza on deck. And that's going to be a strike one right there. We're having some technical difficulties. Just give us a minute here. Get the picture back for y'all. As a foul ball, it's going to be 0-2 on the Lydia there. Give me another foul ball by the Lydia Garza. We'll be back in just a couple minutes.
Sorry about that, guys. I thought the audio was on. I'm sorry. Thank you, Ron Mason, for letting me know. If you uh, missed it, Kristen Webb had a great shot out to the left field over the left fielder's head. Drove in a run. Uh, but Ledia hit it, and they overthrow first. She got on first and advanced. So the runners move to third and second. And up to bat now is Charlie Oglesby. She's hit great all season. It looks like this is going to be a shot. Out to center field, she's going to drive in both runs. She's going to get a double herself. Great hit by Charlie Oglesby. She's hit great all season. That's what you want to see out of one of your great hitters. When you got two outs and you need some points, you put somebody up there like that, and Charlie cranks it out there to center field up against the fence. And now you got Esperanza Castillo. She's done a great job hitting this season. Let's see if she can uh, get us a few more runs. She hit one in the outfield earlier. Let's see if she can do it again. That's going to be inside for ball one. Three nothing is the score. That one's going to be inside again, ball two. Two nose count, top of the third, two away. That's going to be strike one. Two and one is the count on the batter. That's going to be a shot right up the middle. Great shot by Esperanza Castillo. She's going to round third. She is going home. Looks like she's going to be safe at the plate. That's going to make the score. 4 nothing. Ozona, your Ozona Lady Lions are taking an early lead here in the third inning. Got a bit of a Riley going. You got Skylar Lacey coming up to bat for the Lady Lions. See if uh, Skylar Lacey can put one out there. She's done a great job this series hitting. Be a foul ball there. Thank God my truck's not parked over there. My truck would have been parked there, it probably would have hit it. So, the top of the third, 0 oh, 1's a count on the batter, two away. Scores, Ozona four, winner zero. Got Steven Silva listening. He says, let's go Lady Lions. Let's see if we can get a win here. Hopefully get on it here, Steven. That's going to be low for ball one. One and one's the count on the batter. Skyler's going to hit a blooper to center. I mean, to shortstop, she's going to catch it for out number three. But the ladies' lines are going to come away with four runs in the top of the third inning. Let's see if we can get three up, three down here in the bottom of the third. We'll be back in just a couple minutes.
All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're back here. Bottom of the third inning, Lady Lions lead 4 nothing. Trying to get Coach Taylor to come up here and talk with us, but uh, he didn't want to. He said, I'm not up to his standards. Let's see if we can get three up, three down. Coach Reese, thank you for listening. It was a great inning. There's going to be a strike one right off the bat there. He probably didn't hear nothing, Coach, because I probably had it turned down there for a minute. Let me know if y'all can hear me now. Oh, boy. Thought that ball was coming over here to us, but it wasn't. I was waiting for it to come through this window and hit this camera. But we're safe. 0-2, oh, a count on the batter. <laughs> Let me know if y'all can hear me now. That's going to be ball one, one and two, a count on the batter. And the cheering for the softball never gets old. They come up with a new one every game, I think. Thank you, Ryan Mason. That's going to be another foul ball. We're going to run out of balls before the end of this game. going to be a hit right up to Valetti. Valetti's going to throw it to first, get her out. One batter away. Thank you, Coach Roe Reese. I don't know what's going on, but good. glad y'all can hear us now. So one away, bottom of the fourth right here. Been a great game overall. Both defenses are playing pretty good. Just we've had a couple hits in the gaps here. the count on the batter that's going to be a nice hit out to center field Kristen Webb does a great job of snagging the ball almost threw out her first great job of center Webb. let's see uh, Kristen Webb playing center field there so you got a runner on first. She hit single. Number eight's up to bat for the Lady Blizzards. See if uh, Valeria can get us another strike out here. That's going to be a swing and miss. Charlie Oglesby's going to throw it over to second. It's going to be overthrown. And Kristen Webb's going to gun it to third. That's going to be off the mark too. She's going to go home and she will be thrown out at third. She's going to be out right there. Wow, she went out of the baseline. I thought that meant you were out, but uh, I guess it doesn't in Lakeview Stadium. We're going to see what happens. They're going to have a talk now, but if you run out of the baseline, you're usually out. It looks like the uh, umpires are going to have a discussion about that. We'll see what they call. I guess they ain't going to call nothing. Tell you what, you can get away with a lot of stuff here in Lakeview Stadium. Uh, 
I'd like to hear the excuse they gave Coach Dorte on that one. That's going to be inside by one. One and one is the count on the batter. That's going to be hit back to Valetia. Valetia is going to get her out of first base. She's going to run home, and she's going to get tagged out this time. That's going to be three away for your Lady Lions. They're on top of the defense tonight as we head into the top of the fourth inning here. Lady Lions lead four to nothing, and we'll be back in just a couple minutes. All right, we're back, ladies and gentlemen. Looks like we got a Laundra Garza up to bat for the Lady Lions. She had a pretty good hit last time up at bat. Let's see if we can start it off good here in the top of the fourth inning. It's going to be a foul ball. Oh, and one's a count, no out. That's going to be a ball outside. One and one is a count. It's going to be a foul ball again. Oh, and two's a count. You can tell Laundra wants to hit that ball. She's going after it. A lot better than seeing anybody scared of it. And you can tell those on the lady lines are not scared of it. They are anxious to hit the ball and get it out there, put some runs up. That's a good hit. Oh, first baseman's going to drop it, throw it over. And the laundry's still going to be, oh, they're going to call her out. I don't know how they called her out because if that's a baseline error, that should have happened on third base. Well, they're going to call her safe. I'm sorry. I was seeing them both drop the ball. That's what I was confused about. I'll tell you this referee on first base should do some bowling because he can roll that softball straight right at the catcher. So we got Alondra on first with the hit. McKenna Villarreal up to bat, runner on first. Let's see if we can drive in some more runs here. And Alondra's going to steal second base. Great steal there by Alondra. Great slide. Going to be ball one. One and knows the count on McKenna Villarreal.
That's going to be a strike. Uh, outside, going to be one and one. One and one's count on the batter, no outs. Waiting to see what happened. Looks like there's a timeout on the field. Well, we'll have some timeouts. We'll be back in just a couple minutes. We're back here. Had a quick time out on the field, but we're back in action now. I'd like to thank uh, Jared Taylor for sponsoring us with some sunflower seeds up here. Sometimes it's the small things in life. Got one and one on the batter. It'll be a low pitch there. Two and one is the count on the batter. Got a launder on second here. In between the innings, I did find the uh, birds. Wow, there's a shot by McKenna. Looks like the center fielder's on it. She's going to track it. Great shot by McKenna. That's going to be one away. Up next is Faith Kitos. Between the innings, we did find the birds. There's a bird nest and the roof of this booth we're in on both sides. So I don't think they're going anywhere. Unless y'all want me to make them mad. And then everybody will be mad at me let's see if McKenna can get a hit for us here one away I mean not McKenna I'm sorry Faith it's going to be ball one on Faith Faith Kito's up to bat one out Lady Lions leading four to nothing She's going to bunt it. She's going to be safe at first. Alonja's going to be safe at third. Heck of a play by Faith and the Lady Lions there on that play call. Looks like Izzy's going to come up to bat. Let's see if she could drive a run in for us. You know, Coach Reese, I don't know if he played college basketball. He is a very tall man if you're talking about the first base up here. But he can roll a softball in a straight line. I'm telling you, you should get into bowling. That's going to be ball one. Faith's going to advance to second base. Got runners on second and third. One away. Izzy's up to bat with a 1-0 count. Swing and a miss for strike one by Izzy there. She wanted it. Heck of a swing. Coach Dorte's going to give her a little talk here. be a foul ball there well strike either way so one and two's a count on the batter one out here that's going to be a ball one it looks like a laundry is going to come home and she's going to score another run for your lady lines faith Kitos is going to advance to third there Five nothing your lady lines. You gotta be careful here because the Lady Blizzard did come back with a little rally of their own last game when we had a, a lead to start off the game. So we gotta keep that lead going. One and two's the count on the batter. 
So it's actually 2-2, two, two, I'm sorry. And Izzy hits a monster. I hope it's gone. Oh, it hits the fence. She's going to drive in another run. Heck of a shot by Izzy. What a hit. If the wind wouldn't have been blowing in our face, it would have been a home run. And that's what you call a shot right there. I thought it was gone, but it hit the holiday cleaner sign out there. Bounce off the wall. Now you have Kristen Webb coming up to bat. She almost hit a home run last time up to bat. Let's see if she can do it again. And they're really picking on the outfield in these last two innings. That's going to be ball one. And one and oh is the count. One away here in the top of the fourth inning. And the Lady Lions have came alive here in these last two innings. Scoring four in the third and so far two in the fourth. Let's see if we can increase that. It's going to be a foul ball. Oh, one and one is going to be the count on the batter. That's going to be a drizzler out there to the pitcher for out number two. Izzy still on second base. I think that brings up Charlie Ogles, but no, it's going to bring up Valetti. I'm sorry. Valetti Agarja comes up to bat for the Lady Lions. She had a good hit last time. It's going to be a foul ball here. I like how Valetti attacks that first pitch. The young lady from uh, Winners usually throws a fastball on the first pitch. It's going to be inside for ball one. One and one is a count on the batter. Two away. Top of the fourth here. Lady Lions are the visiting team. It's going to be outside, two and one's account. Wind's starting to blow up here. It's going to be another foul ball. So it's going to make it two and two to count on Valeria. Need her to drive one to the outfield. That's going to be a hit out to first base. She's going to drop it again. And she's going to be, oh, they're going to call her out. She looks safe to me. But they're going to call her out. I don't know if that run counts because of the air, but we'll be back in just a couple minutes and I'll find out.
All right, we're back, ladies and gentlemen. Let's see if these Lady Lions can get three up, three down. Leading 6-0, bottom of the fourth inning. Three to go here. Number 12 for the Lady Blizzards is up to bat. That's going to be ball one. See if we can get something started here. Umpire's going to inspect the ball. One and O's account. Let me ball two. That's going to be ball 3-3-0 three, three and oh is the count on the batter. Let's see if the lady can throw some strikes up there. I'm going to get a drink of water. I'll be right back. That's going to be ball four. Better going to take her base up to bat. I think it's number 10 for the Lady Blizzards. She's going to bunt it, which is going to go behind her. That was crazy. That's going to be a foul ball. Owen wants to count on the batter. Swinging a miss, strike two, and uh, Charlie was ready for that young lady to try to go to second. Swinging a foul ball there. Thought she missed it, but I missed it. That's going to be low for ball one. Runner's going to advance the second there. One and two's a count on the batter. We just need one strike here to put her away. That's going to bounce off Charlie's glove. It's going to make it 2-2. Two -two. Two twos to count. Swing and a miss for strike three out number one. Got a runner on second, one away. Number nine up for the Lady Blizzards. That's going to be low for ball one. Great stop by Charlie Oglesby there. Let's see if we can get another out here. One who knows the count, one away. They're going to call that a ball. Strike one, two and one's the count. One away here. She's going to hit that out to center field. Krista Webb's going to get it and fire it to third. She's going to 
He's safe there. One away, runners at, on the corners here. Bring up a new batter, number four for the Lady Blizzards. I'm sorry. Number 15, I'm, I was confused there. She's picking up a bat. There's number 15. This is their only lefty on the team, and she can hit the ball pretty well. We strike one. She's going to hit a foul ball out there towards third base. Oh, two's the count on the batter. She's going to hit it to shortstop. Going to get him out at second. Almost got him turned double play, but they are going to score a run. So, <clears throat> two away, I think, here. Two away here in the bottom of the fourth. Scores six to one. Number four is going to come up to bat for the Lady Blizzard. Looks like we're going to have a timeout on the field. We'll be right back. going to hit it to third. Skylar Lacey's going to snag that line drive. A heck of a play by Skylar Lacey to end the inning here. So the Lady Lions get at three up. Well, not three up, three out. Three outs here. Come in to bat at the top of the six. Your Lady Lions leading six to one. We'll be back to All right, we're back, ladies and gentlemen. Charlie Oglesby is going to lead off the inning for the Lady Lions. Going to be ball one on the batter. Charlie's going to hit a liner up to center field. Going to be safe at first base. So way to start off the inning. Looks like Esperanza Castillo is going to come up for your Lady Lions. Skylar Lacey on deck. Esperanza's been hitting the ball. Let's see if she can hit another one out there. Get everybody moving.
Looks like Charlie Oglesby's gonna steal second base there for your Lady Lions. One and O's the count on the batter, no out. Ball two on the batter. Charlie's going to advance to third base here. Two and zero with a count on the batter. Good shot. He's going to throw it over to first. But with get a first out, but we are going to score a run here. Great hit by Esperanza. Get her an RBI. One away here. Skylar Lacey is going to come up to bat for your Lady Lines. I think Alondra Garza is on deck, and then we go back to the top of the lineup. Swing and a miss by the batter. Skylar Lace is a little ahead of that one right there. All on one's account. That time she gets a hold of it. Goes underneath the shortstop's glove. She's going to be safe at first base. I'm going to bring up Alondra, Alondra Garza for your Lady Lines. I think McKenna Villarreal's on deck. One away here. We got a runner on first. Alondra likes that first pitch. Not that one, though. That one's a little high and outside. Gonna swing at that one, swing and a miss, strike one, one and one's account. And the lady pitching for the blizzards, I believe her dad is calling the signs out here in the stands. Swing and a miss or strike two. <clears throat> one and two's account, one away. going to hit that down the third base line. They're going to call it foul. Foul ball. One and two. Count will stay the same. See if Alondra can put one out there for us. Swing and a miss for strike three. That'll be two away for your Lady Lions. Up to bat next should be McKenna Villarreal. Kenna's done a great job hitting the ball this series also. I'd like to see her put one out there in the outfield. Get the runners moving around. That's going to be strike one. Oh, and one is the count on the batter. Wind's starting to blow. Trying to keep it down up here in this booth. Ball one. One and one's a count. The wind is blowing south to north. And this field is facing to the south. So when they hit those balls, they look like they're going to be gone. And the wind catches them, brings them back in. I believe we didn't have this wind. We'd have two home runs already. 
McKenna's going to hit that down the third baseline. They're going to throw it over to first, and she's going to be out for the out number three. So no runs scored there. Or, well, we scored one run. I'm sorry. But we'll be back to continue the bottom of the fifth in just a few minutes. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're back here in Lakeview Stadium. Bottom of the fifth inning here, Lady Lions leading 7-1. to one. Start off number three for the Lady Blizzards. Strike one on the batter. It's going to be ball high. One and one's a count on the batter. Ball two. Call that one the ball. I think the other team got a few of those as strikes, so we're gonna call that a ball. Make it three and one's account. Three one's account on the batter. Strike two, full count on the batter. Here comes the payoff pitch. I'm going to call that a foul ball. Full count on the batter. Call that ball, so she's going to take her base on ball. Number 21 up to bat for Lady Blizzard here. Oh, she's going to drop the ball there. Great throw.
One and O's account on the batter. No, no out. Bottom of the fifth inning here. She's gonna swing and miss at that. It's gonna make it one and one. Now a ball right there. One and two is the count on the batter. It's going to be a foul ball again. This time it's going to go out of the park. That's going to be ball two. Two and two's a count. He's going to hit that one out to McKenna Villarreal. McKenna Villarreal is going to catch it for out number one. And like I say, when you hit the ball to the outfield, it's going to go up high and short. Number five is up for the Lady Blizzards, one away. That's going to be a pop fly out here to Alondra. Alondra's going to catch it for out number two. Two away here, runner on second. We'll see if we can shut this inning down with no runs here. Go in and maybe get some ourselves. We have scored the last three innings. That's going to be ball one. She's going to advance to third base here. One and those count on the batter. Two away. Swing and a miss. Strike one. And when Valeria finds a zone, she finds a zone. I mean, she could stay in it for a while. Every once in a while, she gets out for a few, but she gets back into it. That's going to be ball two. Charlie actually stopped it and didn't know she stopped it there. Pushed it away when she got up. So it was a good stop by Charlie there. Two and one's a count on the batter. Strike two. Couldn't tell if that was a foul ball or if she just missed it there. It's two two is the count. And they're gonna call that a ball, so full count here. They're going to call her out at home plate. She tried to steal third, and uh, Valeria picked up the ball and threw her out at home. So that's three away for the Lady Blizzards as so we head to the top of the sixth inning. Your Lady Lions are winning 7-1. to one. Let's see if we can put some more points up on the board here. We'll be back in just a few minutes.
All right, we're back here at Lakeview Stadium. Faith Kedos is going to lead off for the Lady Lions. Let's see if she can get something going. She's pretty quick. Like I said, if she hits it out there, it's pretty hard to catch her. That's going to be ball one. One and oh is going to be the count. That's going to be a bump, but it went foul. One and one to count on the batter. She's going to lay down a bunt this time, and she's going to lay it down perfect. She's going to try to steal second here. It looks like she is going to make it. And she's going to go to third, and she is going to be safe. They're going to call her safe at third base, so Faith's going to get a triple off of a bunt there. A few errors along the way, but she is going to get to third base. Great hustle by Faith right there to get to third base. I mean, when she laid down that bunt, she laid it down perfect, and before they even threw it, she was on first base. Up to bat now for your Lady Lions is going to be Izzy. See if Izzy can drive in a run here and start off the inning right. She's going to swing and a miss on that first pitch. 0 oh, and 1 is a count on the batter. That's going to be a ball. She's going to miss it, and Faith is going to score a run. So may Faith makes it around all the bases. Your Lady Lions are leading 8-1. to one. No outs, 1-1 one one on the batter. Strike two, one and two is a count on the batter here. I'm no expert here, but I think if Izzy would scoot back in the box, she would catch the ball when it comes down. And they're gonna call that a ball two. Counts even at two and two. Strike three for the first out. Looks like Kristen Webb's going to be up to bat for the Lady Lions. Kristen Webb had a great shot earlier in the game. Out to left field. That's going to be low for ball one. Kristen Webb's going to hit a fly ball out here to right field. She's going to catch it for out number two. So two away, two up, two down so far. Valeria Garza is going to come up to bat for your Lady Lions. Swing and a miss for strike one. 
Oh, and one's account two away. Let's see if Valeria can start a two out rally here. Foul ball on the second pitch here. 0-2 is going to be the count. It's going to be a fly ball. It's going to be foul out here to right field right in front of us here. So the count's going to stay 0-2, two away, top of the sixth inning here. That's going to be inside for ball one. Foul ball again. Catcher, good hustle by the Blizzards catcher there, trying to get to that foul ball. Count still one and two. Lady is going to hit a ball out to deep center field, and they're going to catch it for round number three. So we had a couple of hits just hit right to our opposite player. So we're going to head into the bottom of the sixth inning here. Lady Lions still leading eight to one. We'll be back in just a couple of minutes. All right, right, we're back here in Lakeview Stadium, San Angelo, Texas. Start off the bottom of the sixth inning. Looks like number eight's going to come up to bat for the Lady Blizzard. Pitch, strike one on the first pitch here. Oh, and one is the count on the batter. Foul ball. 0-2 oh, is going to be the count on the batter. Strike three. Heck of a job pitching by Valeria for out number one. Number 12 is up for the Lady Blizzards. Strike one for Valeria here. 0 oh, and 1 is going to be the count. 1 away. Uh, 
Hit the ball, a little dribbler. Gonna get her out at first. Good job. Favaletti assist her. Alondra gonna come over there. First baseman and the pitcher went for the ball. Alondra came over for second, covered the bag, and they got out number two. You know, they say twins can think the same. I wonder if they're thinking the same there. <laughs> Two away here. Number 10 up to bat for the Blizzard. She's going to hit a foul ball. That's going to make the count 0-1. And, and the birds are back. Be ball one. So one and one is the count. Ball two on the better, two and one's account, two away. They're gonna call that a ball, it's gonna be three and one on the batter. Last three pitches have been a little low. foul ball. It's going to make it a full count on the batter. Here comes the payoff. There's going to be another foul ball here. Count's going to stay full with two away. And that's going to be ball four. The batter is going to take her base. So you got to run her on first, two away. Let's see if we can get this new batter here. Charlie does have a very good arm at catcher there, so don't be surprised if they don't try to throw a young lady still in second if she does. That's going to be strike one. She's going to hit it to Valeti. Valeti is going to get on her knees and throw it to first for out number three. Great job by Valeti to catch that ball and spin around throw it out. So we're headed into the top of the seventh. Our last at bat, we're leading eight to one. We'll be back in just a couple seconds after we hear some words from our sponsor. All right, we're back. Charlie Oglesby up to bat for the Lady Lions. 
That's going to be strike one. 0 oh, and 1, count on the batter here. That's going to be inside for ball one. One and one's a count on the batter here. That's going to be ball two. Two ones a count. Swinging a miss for strike two right there. Charlie looked like she was going to hit that one to the moon. That's going to be ball three. Full count on the batter. Ball. Count's going to stay full. Charlie's going to hit a ball down third baseline. It's going to be foul. Count's going to be full count here still. Charlie's going to hit a paw fly out here. Looks like the pitcher's going to get underneath it for out number one. Looks like that's going to bring up Esperanza Castillo. Skylar Lacey's on deck. That's going to be up in the air going over to first base. She's going to drop the ball and they're going to call it foul. Let's see if Esperanza can put out there. Counts 0 and 1. That's going to be ball one, huh? One and one's a count. One out. Top of the seventh, our last at bat here. Esperanza's going to hit it out to center field, and she's going to catch it straight to the center fielder for round number two. Skylar Lacey's up for the Lady Lions. Let's see if she can get us a two-out rally going here. That's going to be a foul ball. Hit over towards us. Oh, and one's a count, two away. Swing and a miss for strike two. Oh, and two is the count on the batter. See if Skyler can get a hold of one and put it right 
over second base, second base here. Got the outfield playing a little deep here. That's going to be ball one, one and two is the count. She's going to hit that right up the middle. Shortstop's going to get it and throw it over to first. She's going to be safe. Heck of a job and heck of a hustle by Skylar Lacey. That's going to bring up Alondra Garza. Pinch runner here. quick I'm talking to some people here all right now we're getting ready got a new batter Alonja Gar is up to bat got a runner on first they're gonna call that a strike they're gonna call her safe at second One's account, two away. Swing and a miss by Alondra there. Oh, and two's the count. You got a runner on third. Let's see if Alondra can put one in the outfield and get us a run here. That's going to be outside. So one and two is the count. She's going to hit that one right over to second base. Second base is going to throw it to first base for out number three. And it's going to bring us to the bottom of the seventh. Let's see if the Lady Lions can hold off the Lady Blizzards. They're up by seven. We'll be back in just a couple minutes. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're back here. Lakeview Stadium, San Angelo, Texas. Got number 15 coming up to bat for the Lady Blizzards. See if the Lady Lions can hold them off here. That's going to be ball one. Be a foul ball. One and one's a count on the batter. Now 
Ah, it's gonna be hot. It's gonna say it here. Nah, it's gonna say it hit her. I don't know how it hit her if Charlie caught it, but I guess it hit her on the arm. So you gotta run her on first. Better up. You got a runner at first. That's going to be strike one. Charlie better watch it on the first here. Swing and a miss for strike two. O twos account on the batter. Strike three, swing and a miss, and one is down. Two more outs. Number three is coming up to bat for the Lady Lizards here. Gonna hit it to second base. They're gonna call him safe on the corners. She's gonna get her out at third base. So a heck of a job there, and they're they're gonna get her out at second base, and that's gonna be it. Your Lady Lions are by district champions. They're gonna win it. Of a score eight to one. Great play by the Lady Lions on defense. They played the game smart. They got a lot of double plays. I think that's the third double play today. So your Lady Lions are by district champ. We'll find out um, who they play and where we're going to play at next. But that was a heck of a job by your Lady Lions. They lost the first game and come back and won the second ones. But stay tuned with us. Look at the app. We'll let you know where they're playing. We'll keep it on the website, and we'll see you all then.